YouTube. Welcome to another Aussie Outlaws No Bullshit Beer Reviews. And uh, today we've got Menambria. Menambria. All the way from Italy, this uh, beer. Um, it's a 330ml uh, stubby today. And it's 4.8% alcohol. So, yeah, it's got a bit of kick to it, I gather. So this place has been around for a long time and they pride, say in 1846 on the, uh, on the advertising on the front of the label there. So let me just read it. Uh, and the advertising blurb, I had to go and, um, it's on the back there, but it was in Italian, so I had to, uh, had to go and translate it. So it says, Menembria is matured gently in the perfect temperature of our cave cellars for a taste of super clarity. Do you believe in that, YouTube? Do you believe in that? I'll call them bullshit on that, but uh, anyway, let's have a look at this sucker. And there we have the cap for all those cap people out there. Knock yourself out, fellas. Enjoy that cap. Let's see if we can open this sucker. It's, um, don't know if it's a twist top, but let's give it a crack. Definitely not a twist top. Get that opener. Now, we're not going to use the other fucking opener because um, last time that was dreadful. So we'll grab the... Uh, A spare one today. There we go. Not much pop when she opens, but uh, let's give it a smell, eh? Hmm. Very lagery smell. That smells actually like um, some of the uh, English beers I've had over the time. But, uh, anyway, let's uh, pour it and see what she comes out like. Very cold, actually. It's cold out here today. Yeah, um, that is very light beer. I had to sit that, let that sit for a little while because uh, the, I had that glass in the freezer, and it's a pretty cold day here today, and. Um, the uh, whole top of the beer just froze up as I poured it in, but uh, quite amazing. But uh, let's get our first taste test in anyway, first. Here we go. Well, <clears throat> quite surprised. Very lagery taste, like I said earlier. The smell smelled like a traditional sort of uh, English ale lager and um, yeah tastes like it too quite enjoyable uh, I've seen that the, the, they reckon this is one of the number one selling beers in Italy I uh, read on a few places so um, yeah I'm enjoying that taste uh, give it another taste yeah Nice. It's smooth with just a slight hint of a citrus kind of taste there behind it. So it's very subtle, very subtle. Nothing like some of those Mexican beers I was talking about. This is quite good. Traditional type lager beer. It's saying it's a premium. I don't know if they have various um, different ones in their range, but uh, yeah quite like it guys. Let's get some more in us. <sighs> yeah. Good beer. Um, light carbonation once again. It's a very light beer in look. Pale. But yeah, very nice to taste. Um, it's going down very well. Like I said, it's a pretty cold day here today. But um enjoying it 4.8% alcohol got a bit of kick in it and um, about out of 10 tell you what oh, I'm gonna give this a 6.0 a 6 yeah give it a 6 we'll drink the rest of this very nice Yeah, now the one, one that matters, I guess. 
Would I go out in the piss with the boys with this one? Down the pub. Lazing around on a Sunday afternoon. Nothing better to do. I'm gonna give it a thumbs up, guys. I would. Well worth it. Good, medium blend, enjoyable beer. For watching, guys. Menem, Menem Bria. Hope I'm saying that <laughs> close anyway. Not a bad drop. Thanks for watching. Leave a like or a dislike. It's all good. But thanks for watching. That's the main thing. Cheers.